And now, your first alert five weather. Hazy sunshine in the springs this evening, and that haze is going to thicken up just a bit around here tomorrow. 80 is our current temperature. It is breezy out of the north, 19 mile per hour sustained winds. Quite a breeze in Pueblo as well. That's downtown on Union Avenue. 78 is your current temperature. Big time heat in that extended forecast, and it all starts tomorrow. High pressure really the key player for us. That'll bring in more of that hazy sunshine around here tomorrow, and that's your key weather word. It is going to be hotter, and then hotter still for us on Friday. But tomorrow, really not bad if you're out tomorrow morning. Look at these temperatures. 10 a.m., we're in the mid and upper 70s. Not a cloud to be found anywhere. Still mostly sunny during the early afternoon. I think we'll see a few fair weather clouds start to build in late afternoon into the evening. This model wants to bring in a few sprinkles, portions of the Palmer Divide back into the Sangre de Cristos, maybe the Wet Mountain Valley. But again, it won't be much. If you get any rain at all tomorrow, consider yourself very lucky. A few showers and thunderstorms out there right now. Nothing real intense. Got that stuff just across southeastern Pueblo County, Crowley County into some sections of Lincoln County, and then out across portions of Kiowa County. A few very weak showers and thunderstorms moving across. Everything pushing south-southeast at about 15 miles per hour. And once we lose our solar support, that stuff will start to wrap up as well. Pueblo only 82 today. Hope you enjoyed an average high this time of year is 92 degrees. Colorado Springs we topped out at 81 after that morning low of 61 degrees. Outside right now updated temperatures here on News 5 at 6. Very comfortable all across the viewing area. And let me tell you it's rare this time of the year when Woodland Park is warmer than Lamar. They've had quite a bit of rain out across portions of Prowers County. That's rain cooled air out near the Kansas border. Overnight tonight mostly clear skies. Lows really comfortable comfortable dropping back into the 50s here across southeastern Colorado crisp and cool little taste of early fall across some of the higher elevations 48 tonight for that overnight low temperature in Woodland Park around here tomorrow again hazy sunshine afternoon highs hotter than what we had recently 87 in the Springs Pueblo tomorrow an afternoon high temperature of 93 degrees in Colorado Springs hotter still on Friday a little disturbance going to pass to the north of us on Friday that could touch off a couple of thunderstorms across parts of the Pikes Peak region it's really a low chance right now 92 though to launch that weekend on Friday week surge of slightly cooler air backing in on Saturday, back on the frying pan on Sunday, even hotter next Monday. And you can see mainly dry skies around here for at least the next seven days. For Pueblo, get ready to greet the heat. Afternoon highs really hot for this time of the year. Exceptionally hot Friday, maybe a couple cooler on Saturday. It's going to be a dry weekend. You'll want to plant some quality time in front of the air conditioner on Sunday. Even hotter still on Monday. Then another weak cold front backs in by Tuesday, so we'll cool back to 95. And it's always unusual to hear cool back to 95 degrees, but that'll be the case. In Canyon City, you get some of that haze tomorrow. Tomorrow's your only day in the 80s for the next seven days. Red hot readings Friday through the weekend, all the way into the middle part of next week with plenty of sunshine each and every one of those days. For Woodland Park, I've got an isolated thunderstorm in your forecast Friday afternoon. Just one of those passing PM thunderstorms. It hits and then it'll ru run, and that's going to be your only chance of getting any thunderstorm activity up in Woodland Park for at least the next seven days. Say so long to those monsoon thunderstorms. All right, time for traffic here on News 5.